Today, we are traveling to Asheville with our RV, and I wanted to show you a video on what it's like to travel with your dogs. Travel. Whoa. Oh! Keep watching if you want to know what these crazy things do while we travel. I set up the back seat. I put a blanket down for them and then Aspen has like a little bed that she likes because it puts her up a little bit higher and she can kind of sink down in it. When we first started traveling, Aspen would never get in the back seat, but now she really likes that. And Belle likes to sit on the seat between <laughs> us in the car. She hates to go to the back. So when we send her to the back, she's just constantly like, okay, they're gonna let me come back up. I do have to wear leggings on travel days because Vail likes to sit in my lap and she scratches my legs. I always take them a water with us. That's their water. This is not our water. This is their water. So that way they have their own water. And then this here is some stuff that the lady that grooms our dogs, she said that she made it and I'll try to see if I can find out what's in it, but it's for their pads so that it keeps them soft. Like if they get on hot pavement or anything and it's a soothing kind of like a cream for their pads. They also have their own treats as well. And I just have like a little bag that I put it in for them. So that way I know where all their stuff is. Where's that baby dog? What's that baby dog doing? We can't tell Vivelle yet, can we? Because Vivelle, she'll figure it out and get mad, get the crazy, won't she? When we're hooking the camper up, we leave the dogs in the house just because they will get in the way. And you can hear Vivelle barking because she thinks that we're leaving her. And she has just figured out that we are going on a trip. The last thing I do is put her leash and harness on because once she sees me grab those, it's all on. She turns into this wild child, and I'll, and, I'll, and I'll show you that here shortly. A little crazy, ain't she? And she will stay there until the end of time at this point because she's afraid we will leave her. She's over there waiting on daddy because she doesn't want daddy to go without her. This one could care less. That's daddy's girl. Daddy's 
daddy's mean. Make you. There you go. Come on. When you're traveling with dogs, you have to stop more than you normally would just because you got to let them get out and stretch their legs. And every time we stop, I give them water. I used to keep this out all the time, but then she kind of got where she got anxieties and would knock it over and we'd have water everywhere. And she will drink like this. She looks like she's dying of thirst. She literally drinks like this all the time you would think she was always dying of thirst. Nope, see, she doesn't want any. But it's because daddy's not giving it to her. When daddy gets back, he'll have to give her some. Will you give Aspen some water, please? Then they'll go to the back real quick. See, I offered it to her and she wouldn't take it. Daddy has her spoiled, spoiled little doggy. Hey, oh, are you showing them your anxiety? They get excited. They know they're getting water. Yes. And you're fine. You haven't had water in during the morning. So when we get to the site, Typically, I leave them in the car while he levels the camper. And as soon as he says it's level, then I jump in, turn on the air, open the slides, and then I come back and get them. That's just the easiest for us. Now, if there was like a place I could attach them or something, sometimes I'll do that. <laughs> but it's just easier a lot of times just to leave them in the car until we get everything ready. And once we get all set up, we like to take them for a good long walk around the new park. Thank you. 
Where are they at? Where are they at? Huh, baby? Where are they at? Where are they at? Right there. Good girl. Good girl. All right, we are fixing to go take them for a walk here in the rain. Hope you enjoyed this. And if you enjoyed this video, here's Meet Vale and Aspen. Till next time, like and subscribe.